favorite item in your Born Primitive collection? Oh, it's like choosing a favorite child. I I'll know. go with the uh, Rari, Rari bra that I've got on right now. I also named them after me. Um, best horror story as an RA? Um, I think just any time you had to wait in the middle of the night and go deal with some shenanigans and then file a police report. Luckily that only happened a handful of times, nothing like crazy, just people being loud or, you know, smoking or, or something like that. But just, it's like, come on guys. Like I'm not trying to get you in trouble, but you're, <laughs> you're making it hard for me. So what was your favorite sport to play? Growing up? Yeah. Ah, uh, competitive cheerleading. That's my, that was my first and uh, first passion. And I still miss it to these days. Favorite restaurant in Columbus? North Star. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. Um, favorite hair color you've used in a competition? Ooh, I really miss the red. I used to have red hair and I was, I've been considering like going like super like fire hydrant red. So maybe, maybe I'll do that one day or, or, or something else. <laughs> so best Dylan Malitsky story. <laughs> Uh-oh. Um, can't really think of one off the top of my head but I'm sure that there was there was some good times <laughs> um craziest trick you ever did as a flyer probably would have to be like some sort of like pyramid stunt that we did like like regular stunts are just you and then basket toss is where they toss you and then pyramid is like where you're like migrating like stunts together and like going over each other and it can get a little crazy because like sometimes you're leaving one group of bases and going to another group of bases so that was always kind of like the sketchiest and there was a lot of learning like oh can we do this like let's try this and so that was probably the scariest so you've done so many amazing things and you have so many you know things under your belt but what do you consider your greatest accomplishment I don't think think of like one thing to be you know my greatest accomplishment I think that just committing myself to various different goals and sticking it out for however long it takes or whatever it takes to get there is what I'm most proud of throughout my life and something that I you know strive to do for the rest of my life and also just inspire other people to do that too like I think a um, it's easy to feel like ah, I could never do that. So like, I won't even try, but just like committing to trying. And even if you fail, like that's okay because of the person that you are becoming and that it's going to help you, you know, do your next thing that you might not be able to see from there. So I think just that characteristic, um, is, is what I'm most proud of. Is that where the new name for your new line came from? Grit? The grit, it is actually, it's something that I had been, um, you know, kind of going around in my head for a while. And, um, and actually it's a, it's also an acronym for grace, resiliency, integrity, and tenacity. And um, so those things are just like really core to who I am and um, as an athlete and just as a person. And so hopefully can, you know, like I said, inspire others to, to feel that same um, drive when they're doing whatever it is in their life that they're doing and trying to accomplish. So what was the coolest thing you did during COVID? Coolest, uh, building a home gym. I think that was probably the coolest. Uh, we, the, when the gyms closed down here, we were like, uh Oh, what we can't just not work out for an, for an undisclosed amount of time. So luckily, um, Roth's mom lives really close to us and she has a two car garage with high ceiling. It was packed like floor to ceiling with just stuff that you, you know, get for living in a place for 30 years. And she was so kind to let us 
go through some of that stuff, get rid of it. She was actually planning on moving it. So she had gotten rid of some, but then move the rest of it all inside of her house and completely renovate and take over the garage. Uh, we painted it cool colors and we got a custom rig. So that was probably the coolest thing. And last question, tacos or pizza? Pizza, but tacos are good too. 